Hello YouTube. Um we're gonna be covering how to make a um, very simple biome, I guess. Well, um you'll see what we're doing, so um biome, what should we call it? Um Wetlands, why not? And we're gonna select biome, okay. Uh, okay, so I'm going to explain everything right here. Everything right here is basically the generation properties of the aspect of things. So ground block, as you can see here on the diagram, um, would be your top layer. Um, so I you can set it to grass or anything you want. I'm going to set mine to grass. Um, under ground block, that is like stone or... Um, what's basically under it. Um, I'm going to set mine to stone and generate lakes. Does it generate lakes? If it does, check that. Um, vanilla trees. Now that you have a few options for trees. Um, you can either hit custom trees and choose the properties of trees you want. Um, if it has vines, um, the branch block. So you can see the colors here and the colors are there. Uh, maximum height, etc. All right, uh, that's their trees. So you could import trees from, say, MC Edit, um, ones you've made in saves and stuff, and you just choose the file through here. Um, or you could go with vanilla trees. Uh, I think there is no option that you can't go with trees. So, yeah. Um, all right. The next thing is the biome colors. So. If you want it to look like um, something similar to, I don't know, it's like custom, right? So you can change the color and stuff. So if you do want to change the color, uh, check that box. And I'm just going to do a quick, um, what do you call it? Adjust the color quickly. Now I have the colors written down somewhere because I tested it out. So the first one is 175. And 50. And 60. There we go. OK, and that will be our sky. Next one is grass, so I'm going to go to this one and 90. I'm just going to type it out and 75. And the next one is 50. And OK. And last but not least, um, 210. And 50, 50, oh, 50. That's going to give it a whole different look. Not by much, but by some. And that looks like wetlands to me. Looks very moist. <laughs> Alright. So, next thing is um, our. Well, what you want spawning in there is like. So, I'm going to set my minimum. Well, okay, so, pardon me, 0 0.1, let's leave it at that. For first, so how many trees spawn on the chunk? Um, I'm going to set mine to 1 because I don't want that many. Um, how much grass spawns on the chunk? Um, I'm going to set mine to 164. I don't know why, it just seems like a good number. Um, flowers per chunk, um, 24. So, again, it anything that says chunk on it, it's how much spawns per that one chunk. So a chunk is 16 by 16. Um, what are the chance of it spawning on it? So that's what all this is for. I'm just going to fill out this quickly, and I'll be right back with you. Alright, so this raining priority I almost forgot to cover. 
Um, this reigning priority is, um, or possibility, par pardon me. <laughs> um, getting a little carried away there. Um, if you want it to rain a lot of the time, set it to 1. If you want it to never rain, set it to uh, 0. So, uh, and then in between is the percentage that it rains. So I'm going to set it to 1 because it's wetlands. Now, the height, minimum height difference is, um, well, how steep the hills and stuff are, like how steep the landscape and how jagged it is. So I'm going to set this one to 0 and this one to 1. And the next thing that we have over here is the biome gen generation properties. Now, over here is um, how rare it will spawn, 10 being normal and um, smaller being rare. Uh, you could also bring it up higher to like 30 or whatever and it will spawn pretty frequently. Uh, the chance of it will spawn is very common. Um, down here, since the biome update in 1.7, um, you will have these options because the there's different types of climates. So there's warm climates, icy climates, um, cold climates, ocean climates, and um, dry climates. Um, I'm going to set mine to cool. And next is what kind of entities that spawn in your uh, biome. So I'm going to check chicken and cow. And I'm going to check uh, villager. And one more, let's see. horses there we go and finish and there you go your your thing is just going to compile and you're going to be done and I'm going to see you in game all right so we're here and um, as you can see there's a lot of big beasts and the um, landscape is quite steep there's not very few or that not many trees, but um, the water color is different as you can see, and the skies has kind of a bluey haze, and the grass color I wouldn't say is too much different than any other biome, but um, it probably is a little different. Um, yeah, that's about it. So thanks for watching. Subscribe, like, and comment if you feel like it.